Welcome to OFR. In this tutorial, I'll be guiding you on how to assemble the Brimness bookcase from IKEA. For this build, you need a flathead screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, a hammer, a pencil, and an Allen key that IKEA gives you. You can also use a drill with a Phillips or PosiDrive bit to speed up the assembly process. So the first step is to put these two side panels into this orientation. Just make sure that these pairs of holes are facing inwards and are in this position. Also grab eight of these screws. Then screw in the eight screws into these eight holes. The end product will look something like this. Now grab the CL and CR drawer slides and eight of these screws. For this panel, place the CL drawer slides on like this and secure them with two screws. The screws will be going to these holes. As for this panel, place the CR drawer slides on like this and also secure them each with two screws. The screws will be going to these holes. Then grab these three pieces of wood and place them into this orientation. For the biggest piece, make sure the unfinished edge is in this position and also grab four dowels. Next, hammer the four dowels into these four holes. Then grab this piece and place it on like this. Now grab this piece and place it on as shown. Next, place the biggest piece on like this. Again, make sure the unfinished edge is in this position. Then grab four fasteners and secure them into these four holes. Now grab four dowels and hammer them into these four holes. Then flip this part of the bookcase like this. Next, connect the other side of the bookcase. Now grab four fasteners and secure them into these four holes. Then grab four plastic scratch guards and hammer them into these four spots. Now grab the top panel and put in this orientation. Make sure the unfinished edge is in this position and also grab four dowels. Then hammer the four dowels into these four holes.
Next, connect the top panel as shown. And grab four screws and using the Allen key, screw them into these four holes. Now flip the bookcase 180 degrees so the unfinished edges are facing up. Next, grab a pencil and extend the midpoint of both sides like this. Then grab the backing, the bag of nails, and the nail holder. The nail holder isn't necessary if you're comfortable with hammering in nails. I place the backing on like this. Then go to the top left corner with one nail and make sure that the corner is flush on both sides and hammer the nail into this spot. Now grab another nail and again make sure the top right corner is flush then hammer in the nail into this spot. Next, go to the bottom left corner with one nail and make sure this side is flush, then hammer the nail into this spot. Now grab a pencil and extend the midpoint from one side to the other. Try to make the line as straight as possible. Next, grab the other 27 nails and hammer them equidistant from each other all around the backing. Don't forget to hammer in the nails along the midpoint as well. Then place the bookcase against your intended wall. Now grab 12 shelf pins and insert them evenly anywhere you want, but if you're following the instructions, they'll be inserted into these holes. Then grab the three shelves and put them on like this. Now grab two brackets, two washers, and two of these screws and go to the top of the bookcase. Then secure each bracket like this. Unfortunately, IKEA doesn't provide you with any extra screws or wall anchors, so my recommendation is first screw in wall anchors into the wall where the holes of the brackets are located, and then secure the bookcase to the wall using your own screws. So now let's focus on the drawers. Grab this front panel and put in this orientation. Also grab four of these screws and screw them into these four holes. 
Then grab these two side drawer pieces and put them into this orientation. Also grab four dowels and hammer them into these four holes. Next, connect the side pieces like this. Then insert the bottom of the drawer as shown. Now place the back of the drawer on like this. Next, grab four plastic pins and hammer them into these four holes. Then grab four fasteners and secure them into these four holes. Now grab two rubber bumpers and stick them on like this. Next, flip the drawer over, then grab two corresponding drawer slides that are labeled DL and DR and four of these screws. Now go to the left side of the drawer and secure the DL drawer slide using two screws. The two screws will be going into these two holes. Then repeat the same step for the right side of the drawer with the DR drawer slide. Next, grab these two screws and secure them to the bottom of the drawer like this. Now flip the drawer over and also grab the handle and two of these screws. Then secure the handle to the drawer using the two screws. It's going to look something like this. Now repeat the same steps that are related to the drawer one more time. After assembling both drawers, put them in like this. Then check that they open and close relatively smoothly, but if you followed all these steps, then you shouldn't have any issues. So you now have a fully assembled Brimness bookcase from Ikea. Hopefully this tutorial helped you out.